My objective is Tanzania in this series. Tomorrow morning, setting off to where? After collecting supplies, I hop on a minibus for Arusha. Entering Tanzania was easy. All it took was a $50 visa. I was in Arusha to await the arrival of Ben, the proud owner of an ancient land cruiser. My comfortable lodge included cheap $25 per night backpacker rooms. The fee included all the amenities and a buffet breakfast. When Ben arrived, we made fast plans and hit the road. Our first goal, the Indian Ocean. Bye, it was a fun five days. We are at a campsite just outside Arusha National Park. Ben's gear included lots of old stuff he had accumulated over the years. Some we gave to charity and some we kept for bribes and gifts. Center of Moshi Town. The first problem is solved. Money. We stopped at intervals for gear money, stuff, and if I need some flip-flops, there's some Michelins, and terrible food. The zebra camp offered an empty riverside campground for the evening. I soon discovered that Ben had a routine, each object in its place and dinner prepared with precision. It's uh, around seven o'clock. Free canoes? Let's pretend we're Canadians, eh? We were told that there are only little crocodiles in this river. Wow, who gets to decide what's little? On the road again. Well, we made it to Tanga. Beautiful looking place. So where are we heading at this stage? Pangani. Serious looking tree. Near the end of the day, we pulled over and tested the waters of the Indian Ocean. Yep, salty. 